All right. So uh, this is going to be Leo Sun, Leo Moon, and as well Leo Rising, a weekly uh, career and business tarot reading, uh, February 10th to uh, February 16th, 2020. And uh, in case any of you guys is interested into a uh, personal reading with me, you can check out the description down below. And uh, there you're going to find a link to my website from which you can purchase one and as well a link to your other video of the week which is going to be focused on a uh, relationship and law. So the first card in terms of a career and business here we do have the five of wands followed by the next one which stands as the energy is feeding up the uh, business and career situation which is the energy of the devil card. Followed by the next one, which represents the challenges that you will need to overcome for throughout the week. That is going to be the uh, Ten of Wands. Followed by the next one, which represents the gifts and the blessings that you can enjoy throughout the week. That is going to be the Empress card. Afterwards, it is the impression you are going to give into the people around, meaning your co-workers, your boss, your supervisor, etc. That is to be the... Uh, uh, justice card and then the last one that we do have for you guys which stands as the guidance the tarot is offering that is to be the uh, judgment so we do have the justice then we do have the judgment four out of six major arcana major week uh, all right so let's focus first on the first cup of cards here and we can see the majority of the week not the majority but the importance of the week into those uh, into those cards so we do have the energies which is the devil card and uh the devil man i mean this is one of the best cards that could come into energies because that's it's like your person that that you are start to fulfill your own personal life if you will because what the devil is it's how the devil defines one's soul, right? And um, what, it, what, what defines it if, if it is not the flame within that, that uh, combusts and, and conf conflagrates and burns for life itself. And the fuel of this flame or the fuel of your soul, that is, it is the goals you have, the yearnings you have, you know, and the, and the dreams, if you will, as well. And as the energy... The devil gives you the meaning, the, the means, excuse me, not the meanings, the means and the resources to fulfill those dreams. It gives you the means and the resources, okay? Now, it is entirely up to you how you're going to use those means and how you're going to use those resources. Because uh, the devil is taken as a very negative card in tarot that is because people get intoxicated by power and that's that's usually what happens they find themselves in a position of power and they start abusing that power and then you know the devil takes the dark turn of the card but the positive turn of the card it is when you feed the hunger of your soul you actually fulfill your dreams but there is a long way to go before that happens it is because we do have the five of ones here which stands as the topic of the working situation. So that card tells us that based on your yearnings uh, and the, actually the openings that you can accomplish your yearnings, this week will become very dynamic, all right? And there will be not a single opening, not a single opportunity or not a single surprise that you're not going to see as a, a profitable gaining for enterprise, all right? And therefore, you are to be able to accomplish a lot of around turns, especially into projects that are severely deteriorating, if you will, only for the reason to prove yourself capable in front of those who are judging you, your boss or or your supervisor and those two cards here are pointing that if someone scratched you out meaning that they have gave up on you or any hope on you well they could have not been more wrong with those two cards because you're going to prove everybody wrong here that have uh, abandoned hope once again uh, in you fantastic cards for a uh, emerging victorious after taking a blow right uh, career 
uh, career and business wise but uh, with those cards as well it's very important you know once again how you take advantage of the resources given meaning time you know green lights for to execute certain projects or to establish a private businesses because uh, by by their nature the resources are going to be very neutral and you can you you have a decision to make here are you going to use them to destroy or are you going to use them to create and to product uh, so just to summarize all that here leo throughout this week you are going to have the power to force your own circumstances guys do not miss your chance it is all that is asked here and when you have a certain hunger meaning you do have a certain goal just just move toward it because you're gonna have the power to do so right in term of business and in term of a uh, in term of a career but once again this uh, your uh, this personal enthusiasm and this personal drive that you're gonna have itself is going to force a lot of dynamic around and is gonna allow you to once again a prevail in the situations when everybody thought that you were gonna fail now the challenges that you will have to face here however are the challenges of the nine of the um, ten of wands and uh, the uh, the routine that you're gonna involve yourself in throughout the week in order to fulfill the dreams of your heart say that way in terms of business and career will demand a lot from you so that is a uh, like a high investment from your behalf but not money not at all this is an investment into time this is investment into sacrifice meaning that you have to spend for example many um, hours on top of your working hours therefore you have to sacrifice a time with your family instead and etc etc so we are talking about a personal sacrifices that you need to do in order to fulfill the expectations of the goal and the dream that you do have in terms of business and in terms of career so you want to be a successful you want to become one day ceo in the company that you are working at or well, you have to bust your ass especially this week because once again this week it is where you can definitely build up the, the foundation of that dream to become true you're gonna have the uh, the means you're gonna have the right circumstances as well through the dynamic of the week also and you simply can uh, can actually push into that direction even more than that you can force your own circumstances but all comes to that can you maintain them afterwards all right we are talking about here we are talking here excuse me about maintenance of your own personal drive of your own personal wishes because one thing is to accomplish something the uh, an entire other thing is to be able to maintain it because uh, the ten of wands here points that you are going to be in a position of power at the end of the day but can you handle that position it is the question that remains to be seen as an answer and our next one it is uh, what gifts and blessings you can enjoy throughout the week uh, here we do have the empress card and there is only one way how we can see that card uh, actually a couple of ways excuse me the first one it is that whatever creativity you engrave into your work is going to be faced with a lot of appreciation okay so you cannot go wrong well, if you decide to uh, attempt a creative actions into your project and the other gift and blessing here is whatever plan you create throughout the week is going to go a, a long run okay so if you decide if you um are to plan something that is the week you do it because once again you're going to have the means the resources and the circumstances that you can rely on moving forward into the future in term of business and in term of career just to give you an example here you want to start your own, your own business that is the week you start planning it okay and that is the week you establish the very first steps you kind of like scope the moments for how to start that business all right so next one it is a how people are gonna take on you what kind of an impression you are leave into people and that will be the justice card so with the justice card that is one of the best cards in terms of how people see you in career first of all they are to see you very responsible now uh, some people may say that that could be true for the for the emperor 
Not exactly. Now with the justice, they see you very responsible, while with the emperor, they see you very reliable. That are, these are two different things, okay? So very responsible and also a, a person who uh, very well is very capable to manage their time and never miss a thing. Also a person who is with astute discernment of what is worth it and what it doesn't worth it. And, and that could itself, uh, how can I say, build up a, your following because people will know if you decide to go for something, it definitely has profit in it, right? And if you decide to establish a, a, a business, say, that is going to be not just only where you're working in it, but you are actually gonna hire people with that car, it doesn't look like that you're gonna starve for a uh, uh, for a candidate to be a, a part of your business. But uh, in terms of working in company, this card puts a, a big trust in uh, in your boss and in your supervisor to give you a, a workload, and that is exactly what you need a, a workload so you can prove capable that you can raise into the ladder of the hierarchy in term of a working career and in term of the company itself that you can show that you are more than those who are working around you and with you as well. And the last one here is going to be in a term of a guidance that uh, Taro is offering to you. We do have the judgment. And with this follow up, the, ju the judgment actually tells us only one thing as a guidance. Whatever is given to you throughout this week as an assignment in term of uh, business, as a, a client that approaches you, all right, or as an, an endeavor, as a task, that will be something that is going to excel you, that is going to propel you moving forward into the future to hoard your dream. Because this is what the judgment is all about when, uh, you know, when up until now, if you have been baffled how you are going to become, say, CEO, you know, now you can clearly see the path to, toward this goal. And uh, how can I say it? And it's not it's not happening overnight, guys. Probably it's going to take months, years maybe. But the, what is important here is that you finally see the path how this is to happen. So uh, it's a very potent reading for those who are just starting their career. Pretty much those cards are pointing that whatever they have, whatever they are imagining for themselves that they are going to be, they can definitely go there, right? And this week is going to be crucial because they are going to see how that is to happen. And it's very important to grasp the moment and do what you have to do in order to manifest that how, okay? So because I recently saw a comment in one of the videos that we are talking only about positivity, that reading is completely neutral. I mean, what I'm telling you is what potential you have, but also it takes your participation into that potential so the, pot so the potential can unfold and become true because you are going to have the means, you are going to have the opportunity, you are going to have the pleasant surprises, but if you don't do anything about it, nothing is going to happen to you throughout this week and you are going to work the same place for the same salary to the rest of your life, say. Okay, and not just only with that opportunity, you may have many other so many other opportunities, but you cannot expect that they are going to unfold for you. You have to unfold them for yourself. So that being said, Leo, this was your weekly uh, career and business reading, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it and you liked it. And uh, once again, if you're interested into a personal reading with me, you can check out the description down below. And uh, there you're going to find a link to my website and as well a link to your other video, which is going to be focused on a relationship and love. And with that being said, hopefully we're going to see each other around. And until then, bye.